I forgot to mention one thing uh, that consumed a lot of my time. This uh, black motor mount back here, poorly printed. Again, all of my black parts appear to be uh, 3D printed, plastic parts, um, which I'm not happy about, but so be it. You're required, given the length of the different screws in your kit and the shallow depth of thread to be able to mount the motor, you're required to use the 10 millimeter length uh, M3 bolts, which is fine, but um, they were too short. I actually had to drill, I had to drill it out twice. I had to drill down so that the threads of the bolt could stick out further as well as I had to drill out the hole to be able to push the bolt through. So hopefully you've watched these videos in advance. Um, this motor mount piece, drill it before you put it even in the uh, x axis unit. Um, before you even put them on the threaded rods, go ahead and drill that out a little bit. Do a test fit on this motor, just make sure it works. Uh, also, I have no idea what size Allen keys I'm using or Allen wrenches I'm using. I've got three different ones here for different things. Well, you're going to need two. I had to get a bigger one so that I could mount my uh, power supply with uh, the screws that I bought from the hardware store. But the pulleys use a smaller one. I know they're metric. I have no idea what size they are. Sorry. Uh, so you're just going to need a small metric uh, Allen key set for when you're working on this. Alright. Moving forward.